Oh. Oh, they say that now. Okay, that's cool. All right. So um, last week we talked about the social media calendar and we talked about content. Um, you know, just different places you can find content. But I want you guys just to think about this, you know, leverage everything, leverage, leverage, leverage. I mean, these suppliers send us stuff, um, e-magazines send us stuff. And when you are sharing content on your page, can you guys hear me okay? Because I want to make sure I'm, I'm not, you know, I know the internet sometimes kind of crazy. If you can, just um, type yes or hit one if you can. Um, make sure. Can you guys hear me? Okay, great, 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 great. So you want to leverage and you also want to put a call to action. And a call to action really lets people know what you do or you telling them what you want them to do. And you got to remember, um, we have attention spans that are very short when it comes to human, human beings. So we also have to point people to what we want them to do, okay? It, it's just common sense as a marketer. And you think about the commercials that you see, you know, they tell you what to do, but we hear them so much, we may not think about what they're telling us to do. You know, it's a, it's a subliminal thing. It's like, we see a commercial, a nice car, and it says, come on out for zero APR. You know, it tells you that. So also make sure you're doing that with your posts. If you're not saying, contact me for all your travel needs. Let me know when you're ready. We're here for you when you're ready to travel. Just anything to let them know that that's what you do. And engage and connect with your audience. That's important. Because, you know, um, people have to know, like, and trust you, and you have to build brand loyalty as well. You know, some of us have brand loyalty to different brands. And, you know, certain things we won't buy, you know, because we have brand loyalty. So this is going to help you as well. But what we're going to do, we're going to, um, I'm just going to share with you just how simple this is just to grab content. And what we're going to look at first, let me make sure everybody's muted. Um, what we're going to look at first is electronic magazines. And I'm not sure if you guys subscribe to any, but I'm subscribed to two and I get all kind of stuff. And what I typically do when I get my emails, I put them inside a folder so I don't have to go and figure out where they are. Okay. And my folder is called marketing material. And I send some of you guys some of this stuff. I know some of you, you know, I try to help you out because I know this is new and it's a lot. And, you know, we got lives going on. So I just like to kind of, you know, hold your hand until you kind of get the, the hang of it. But you also want to think about your ad as well. Don't make it so long. Like I said, people have a small attention span, just enough to kind of get them wondering, well, if I contact them or I want to go. And, and also you got to consider all we're doing, we are professional plant seed planters. You're planting seeds. You're planting seeds. That's all you're doing. And you want other people to know what you do because guess what they do when they're in the grocery store, they're around their family and friends. You buy real estate in their mind about what you do just by what you share. Okay. So we're just going to start with something real simple. This is Condonas. This is free. And you see 14 best beaches in the United States, right? So if I click on this, it's going to give me the 14 best beaches. But I don't want to put all 14 best beaches. I just want to put one beach. So I want to just show you this real simple. I'm just going to copy this. Best beaches in the US. Just going to copy this. And, and are you guys familiar with the snipping tool? That's a great tool if you're not, if you don't know about it. But this is all I do. I can go grab this, paste. Best beaches in the United States, right? In the US. I go back to that ad. I don't know about none of these places, but I'm just gonna grab something. I'm just gonna grab this. Boom. Come here. Uh oh, let me put this right here so I'm gonna be looking for it. Come on. Condonado, Con Con Coronado Beach, San Diego. And I can grab just a snippet, just a small piece of information. One of California's most popular, be most popular beaches blah, 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 boom. I post that on my page, make it nice and clean. You see, it's not a whole lot. I'm gonna get an emoji because I want you to be able to read it, you know, because if it's too long, what do we do with long posts? We keep on reading. 
unless it might be some drama, but that's a whole nother conversation, you know? And I'm just gonna grab a picture of this. That's it. I'm gonna grab a picture of this. Just that picture. This is my snipping tool, by the way. All I did was grab this, pull it over. And guess what? I come to my page. I post it. And I put con contact me for all your travel needs. And if I want to get fancy, I can go grab some hashtags. And the way you grab hashtags, just come to Google, hashtags for San Diego. Or beaches, we just say beaches. And I just copy this. You see, I'm, I'm not, I'm making this up on the fly with you guys right now. I didn't rehearse this. I just want to just show you how simple this is. And I'm just going to put a few, you know, not a whole lot. And travel agent. Now, you see all I did? Best beaches. Now, what if I did, I got 14 now. You see, I got 14. I could do one next week. I can want do one on Saturday. I can do one the week after. And I know nothing about these beaches. You follow what I'm saying? But what I did was buy real estate in someone's mind about traveling, but I also, I want you to pay attention is, oh, it's not posting yet? Okay, here we go. And you see it's not bundled up. I can put another emoji there if I want to, but it's not required, but it's just real simple, real simple, right? But I want you to pay attention. Contact me. I want you to contact me. Nobody else. I don't want you to go looking for this or no. Contact me. That's very important. You want to also have that call to action. Now, they have all kind of stuff. Top city hotels. Top 15 hotels in New York. Top, top 15 city hotels in Chicago. So it doesn't have to be all international travel. It could be anything that this... Um, publication gives me and I don't have to use everything at the same time as you see I didn't put the link I just took something from the story so I'm just going to do another one I'm going to do this one and, and it don't have to be resorts it can be food it could be a tip but I just want to show you how to make these ads and, and you see we're not selling anything you see all we're doing we're going to just put Top 15 resort hotels in the continental US, but I'm going to take the 15 out because I don't want to talk about all 15. I just want to talk about one. Top resort hotels in the continental US. Can you guys hear me okay? I know sometimes it may drop out. And I'm just going to grab this. Which one I'm going to grab? Okay, Wyoming. Boom. Just going to copy this picture. Now, the great thing about, uh-oh, the great thing about this, I may not want to add anything about it, add anything about the property. I just want to post a picture just to let you know what I do. Hold up. Oh, man, don't show off. Sorry about that, guys. Come on, come on. Well, Right now it's giving me a challenge, but all I'm gonna do is come here. Post that picture. And what I'm gonna put, contact me for all your travel needs. It's right there already. I can copy and paste it. I can come back here. I want to put the name with it. Real simple. And if I want to put hashtags, I can put hashtags for continental US, Wyoming, travel, whatever it may be, right? Put me a little emoji right there. And the emoji just kind of break it up for people, you know. Or I may want to say, um, we will see the world again. We are seeing the world again.
The name of the magazine is Travel and Leisure, but it's it's quite a few. Um, Condonis, let me see, Condonas. Uh oh, Condonas Travelers is a good one. Travel and Leisure is a good one, and they just send me stuff all the time. I just save it. I just save it, and and because I can't be travel, travel, travel all the time, I give it to a lot of you guys. So you could use it on your page, but and, and I also want you to consider this: just because I post this today, that don't mean I can't post the same thing over and over and over. Not every day, but ask yourself: when you see Super Bowl commercials, everybody's excited about the Super Bowl commercial, right? But is that the only time you see that commercial, or you hear an ad on the radio? You you know, and, and think about it this way as well: you also you also want to um, add people, add new friends. Just make sure they're not the crazy ones. You know, add new friends because when you add a new friend to your social, somebody adds you to your page. Somebody adds you. See, I'm adding um, hey, ugh, we'll just say Ms. Rose. I'm adding Ms. Rose. Ms. Rose may look to say, well, how do I know this person? Or let me go look at their page. And if you go look at my page, and you seeing stuff like this. It's, it's attraction, which you add people to your page. Why well, I'm going to add this person to my page? And you see, like, contact me for all your travel needs. You think, oh, this person is a travel agent. And like I said, remember, we're professional seed planters, so we always got to be planting seeds, and some of these seeds going to go with other people and get inside their networks. And always be thinking about that. You have to connect before you collect. You have to connect with people. Um, and next week... Like I said, my trainings aren't going to be long. And if you got here late, um, click on the link and add yourself in the group because this is going to be recorded. You can come back and watch it because I know some of you work at night and have families and can't get on some of the other trainings. I just want to, you know, go to extra miles just to kind of show you different things you can do with your business. And, and if you look there, you see all that was was where I found that content. I mean, that content was in a travel electronic magazine. You also can get stuff from and teletravel emails. They send us all kind of stuff and take advantage of their, their marketing program. It's free marketing, take advantage of that. Um, I just show you something real quick. I don't wanna get you in and out. Let me see here, and teletravel, uh, let's log in. And, and like I said, you know, your, 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 your content, let me go back here. Your content doesn't have to be all travel. It can be destination, travel tips, things to do in that location, something personal about yourself. You know, a lot of you do very, very well with your personal life. Me, I'm working on that because um, it's about the business with me. And, you know, but you got to show people who the person is behind the um, computer. But if you come here and you go to um, VIP Partner Exclusives, and this is Ensemble, and I, I challenge some of you, please watch these videos. I haven't watched them and I feel bad telling y'all to do something I haven't done. But Ensemble is probably the most powerful tool we have in this business, okay? It's a marketing system. But when I come here, I wanna show you something, how you can just use the stuff that they have. You know, they, they give us this stuff. So I'm gonna come here to Marketing Social Share. Now I'm gonna show you something that's real simple that you can do. Um, we're going to, I'm just going to click on this one. Basically all these right here, if you click on them, you can share them, but I don't want to share them. I'm going to show you how they look though. Cause I want to share it the way I want it. I want to have my personality on it. So I'm just going to say adventure begins at the edge of the world. And I'm going to post that on my page. And if I'm going too fast, let me know, but this is recorded. And I'm just talking about our Antarctica, Antarctica. Even just saying sounds adventurous. I'm just grabbing one sentence. You see, I'm, I, I ain't even reading it, and that's that's bad. I shouldn't tell you all that, but I'm just showing you how simple this is. Just making an ad, and the great part about it, I can click on that. I can grab that, copy that link. 
post that on my page. Contact me for all your travel needs. Contact, oh, let me go copy it. I'm sorry, guys, I'm a copy and paste. I like to make it real simple. And what you could do is you can save this stuff. You can send it to your messenger. So you always have it. So if you're sitting in a hairdresser, you're like, hey, I didn't say nothing about my business today. Let me go see what I have in my messenger. You follow what I'm saying? Let me see. How can we add ourselves to rewatch this? Okay, you fine. You see where it says Facebook group, Jessica? I'm going to post that down there again. Boom. There you go, Jessica. Oh, I sent that to Sharita. My fault. Everyone in the meeting. There you go, Jessica. It's right there. And I'm just going to post that on my page. I may add a little emoji. And the reason why I add the emojis, I just like for it to break it up. I mean, you don't, it's not required, but for me, it just looks a little cleaner for me because I know people, y'all probably heard this before. People don't like to read. Anybody ever heard that before? So I like to just point your eyes what I want you to see. I'm just going to post that on my page. You know, it, it wasn't nothing major, but it goes back to your, your DMO, which is your daily method of operation. You see, I did where I got my content from. I got some content from IntelliTravel. I mean, from the back office, right? From right here. I got this here. And this back here for you, there's, there's tons of them. And I got some content from Condonista Traveler, which is an e-magazine and Travel and Leisure, you know. Um, but at the end of the day, it's the consistency that you have with your business, which is going to drive your business. And always remember, people will not like, but they will look. We're not looking for likes. We're looking for looks. Now, we can post engaging content, and we'll go over that on another training. Um, but next week, I want to show you how to do videos. Videos are so crazy and easy. You're going to laugh. And just remember, I like to keep things short and sweet, but that may not be your thing. I want my ad to be short, sweet, to the point. And I don't just post on my page. I also post in groups, you know, because you want groups of people to know what you're doing. And I also can engage with those people in those groups. And we'll go over that in another training as well. Um, it's 917. I know I went kind of fast. And for those who got on late, please add yourself in the Facebook group that I started. So you guys can start looking at these trainings and you also can we will do a poll to see what you want to train on you know i don't do many vendors but me i i love marketing you know it, it's all about letting people know what you do does anybody have any questions you can type them or come off of mute i think everybody can come off of mute well going once, going twice. I want to thank everybody for getting on. Um, we're going to do this again next Thursday. I know I sent you this um, late and I do that on purpose because I sometimes we get stuff early in the day and forget, but just put it in your calendar that we're going to do it um, every Wednesday, every Wednesday, I mean, sorry, every Thursday. And they're going to be real short and sweet, not nothing long. And I just want to show you different things that you can do to your business because you know none of us may not have a marketing degree but we can post we can post stuff that's already made and we can make it real nice and 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 and, and we just you know we, we want to be nice to people and we want to get their business but it also helps you build that know like and trust um so thank you so much for tuning in guys the training to be the recording to be in there probably tonight if not in the morning and i want to just thank everybody and I appreciate each one of you. And I want you to know that, um, hey, if your business not growing the way you want it to grow, just pick up your activity and just stay consistent with it. Because if I can do this, anybody can do this. Anybody. All right. So thank you so much for tuning in. And I'll have this in the, um, the group. All right. Take care.